I'm telling you, I've done it. Oh my word. Oh my word. Yes! <laughs> Hello and welcome back to the channel. I'm Alex. I'm Jack. I'm Ethan. And today we're doing a challenge video with a difference because we're going to buy a 500 pound car and then we're going to take that car onto a track and do battle against a brand new Renault Megane RS. It's going to be tough. Up for it? Easy. Easy. Yeah. Easy. Yeah. Oh. Oh. I'm feeling a victory. Onwards. No, no way. <laughs> So like I said, we are pitting it against a Megane, but there is a caveat because we've got a special guest driver and it's you. <laughs> Yay! Before we crack on, I know the Christmas tree will throw a few of you. No, I don't have a Christmas fetish. This was just filmed in late December. Right then, let's buy a car. To give you a bit of a chance, I'll show you basic kind of how to drive. Okay. My track experience is pretty limited. Okay, well tomorrow it's going to be pretty <laughs> awesome. And then it's up to me to get our ship box as close to the Megane with you driving as mm -hmm. possible. Now, we have some rules. The car can be no more than 500 pounds. Has to have a valid MOT. Has to also be reliable because I have to drive it up. I don't know where to start with this one, really. Start from the top and then work your way down. Just like you did with me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, have it straight away. Have the winning car right, right here. Cool. We got a little little Ford Puma oh, track car. Ford Puma. Please tell me it's a one seven. It is. It's not far. A one seven. But it has got a cage in it, so I can't check the MOT of this because it hasn't got a number plate. So not even on the front. No, not even none on of the, the pictures. Not even on the front or the back. Okay. What about a street KA? I'm guessing you found that because it's your favourite car. You've got some experience, haven't you, in, in KAs? I do. It? Yes, I do. I've been racing in, oh, a, wow. in a KA series. That yes. could be a big advantage for you. Mm. Tell us more. No, no. Yes, no. yes, yes. Not to, more, not more. To oh, that's yeah. definitely not a track car, but it's very cool. Don't tell me you don't like that. Oh, yeah. Can I just say, if, you do, if we do happen to get an MX-5, can we make sure it's silver because I need new wings? When I saw the cover image of this, it looked like someone just like put their Zephyr in a ditch <laughs> and now that, it so they'd advertised it. Like. Can you remind me that my dog's outside? Oh my word. Oh. There is a street KA with a short MOT for £475. Shit. Is this not. for the video or is this for your life? Both. Okay. I will take it afterwards. <laughs> oh, why do you not have MOT? <laughs> You're perfect! Two and a half litre swapped compact E36 oh, with wow. buckets, wow. oil overs. <gasps> that would have given it a good run. No I, MOT! I know someone who can do us a dodgy Emma. <clears throat> no BMWs. Every other week we do a BMW. BMW. Shut up. E Street KA. Street KA and football. Oh, oh that's nice. It, that is a cool car for £500. I can't believe I just said that's a cool car. Yeah. It's ironically it is. cool. It is. It's ironically It's not cool. ironically cool. It is cool. You've literally got no idea. BMW 3 yes. Series. Yes. 316i. That's going to be so slow. That'll be so slow. Oh, God, the dog's outside. Oh. <gasps> hey, Maisie, do you want to come back in? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Hyundai Coupe Sport. <gasps> it's a 2.7 V6. Long MOT, service history, everything works as it should. Really fast and fun car to drive. I've done it. Nah. I've 100%. Nah, it's, 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 yeah, it's, yeah, it's, yeah. it's a, it's a yeah. 2.7 V6. I'm already bored. Shut yeah. your mouth. 165 horsepower. Don't make Is a that at me. it? I'm telling you, I've done it. Thank you for the tea. You're very welcome. Which has just appeared. <laughs> <laughs> you know when you nice. said um, silver MX-5s? Yeah. You got one. Got MOT till August next year. Car was running well, but has developed a misfire. Why do you keep on well, filing yeah, cars yeah. that are broken? No, no, yeah, but you you get that for four fifty, and then we swing by Halfords and get some spark plugs, and we'll swap them in it. I bet that solves it. It's it's a very big risk. I thought that was the, that's the only thing that's going to get him off this high. And then fire. Yeah. Who did you leave the tea bag in this? Yeah, you know I love the tea bag. You're a monster. What? Just admit I've done it. I just just to shut you up. 225 brake horsepower. Which would be what engine? That's going to be the 1.8. Carry on. Liter. Yeah. Boosa. Did you find your second tea bag? What? How long has that been in there? 
Well, I put mine in there ages ago. <laughs> Why have I, uh, I have had all three in there? Yeah. <laughs> what have you got? So, well, let me know, let me check. Okay, let me, okay. I need to, I've learned now. God, oh my God. <laughs> so, dead battery. Well, let me check the MOT, because it's... Oh, I've, I don't even know what it is yet. Someone <gasps> getting too excited. <gasps> yes. You might have it. It's got bits on it as well. Yeah, I saw, it's I saw got, it. he's listed out, like, it's got a Sparco something or spark plugs or... April? April, it's got MOT. Okay, so it's got <coughs> the front chassis legs have been welded and are solid. Cars view modification, Sparco ref bucket seat, K N air filter, cobalt quick shifter, stickers, racing pedal covers, decap pipe, blah 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 blah. Six hundred pounds. Yes, Ethan. <laughs> One hundred eighty-eight thousand miles. Perfect. And it could Perfect. Do it. it could do a couple more tomorrow. <laughs> we'll phone him up. Okay, we'll phone him up. We can't say any further than that, can we? No. Right, I'm on page 100, so I, can't, <laughs> I think I better stop here. Uh, I am on page win. Alex has been, you know, he's been banging on about this Hondo Coupe, and I thought, yeah, I'll check it out. Maybe I can get on board. Maybe I will like it. And I've just gone to open the ad, and it says the ad is no longer available. That was the one chance I had to get 10 points. Don't worry. <laughs> it's okay. I've still got to phone him. Don't not pick up as well. I'll be... Hey, yeah. Hello, is that Sam? Yeah. Hi, mate. Um, I see you've got a Hyundai Coupe up for sale. Yeah. Oh, you still have it? Yeah. I've got a really tight budget. I only have £500. Yeah, okay. The car drives okay? The car drives perfectly. Okay, perfect. All right, bye. Bye-bye. Oh. Yes! That is a lesson to everyone. Some, if you I, think something, something's gone. No, something's not right here. There was no, like, he was like, okay. I know. <sighs> it's great. He does sound really dodgy. He does sound really yeah. dodgy. Our four cars are the coupe, yeah. compact, yeah. and then two, two MX-5s. Yeah. You do one, I'll do the other. How about that? Okay. You uh, do the more expensive one. All right. Like, hang up. Yeah, call it. Have we had a look Hello at the. Mate. Hello, mate. Uh, you have a Mark II MX5 for sale for £650. Okay, yes, mate. Yeah, that's still available. Perfect. Um, is the engine happy? Gearbox is all good? Yeah, yeah, it drives absolutely fine, mate. Yeah, really nice. I have a very, very tight budget of, um, of £500. Uh, I know it's a little bit low, but if that's something you yeah. consider. Then I would. No, it wouldn't be, wouldn't be that low, mate, I'm afraid. Sorry, I'm, okay. I'm only a small trader. I put my cars up cheap. I don't make a lot out of them. And it's, it's already really cheap, so I definitely wouldn't be able to go that low. Okay, thanks very much. I, uh, I may give you a call later. Thank you. Cheers, bye. Bye-bye. And then, no, he's not replied. So, yeah, by default, do. the high end I could. No, he might do. He might do. We're gonna, we've got to go to West Kebab. I've got time, yeah? Oh, yes. Yeah, I was call calling it about it earlier. Is it still for sale? It is, yeah. Yeah, I'm very interested. Can you do 500? Yeah, I'll do 500. Yeah, I'll have a chat and I'll give you a call back in a bit. This one's got me going, like... This is, it's got bits on it. This one's making like... me tingle a bit. Yeah. <laughs> also, the guy was really nice on the phone. He was really nice, And that yeah, other yeah. guy was shady. Oh, I think... What do, what do you think? Are they screaming MX-5? I think what we're going to do is we're going to have to eat on it. Eat on it, yeah. Yeah, yeah, we'll yeah. eat on it. All right, that's a good shout. Yeah. Right, I've made my decision. Oh, have you actually? Yeah. So I'm thinking Mark II, 1.6, got a few very subtle mods. I think it's good for a 42. If it stays dry. And, oh, that's a big if. That is a big if. I think it's scheduled to rain tomorrow. All right, let's just hope that that decat yeah, yeah. does it justice. 
and also let's hope that it being quite a high mileage one because it's on 188,000 miles. Oh yeah. Let's hope it's been looked after. Rust. There it is. There it is. And there's another MX-5 as well. Oh my word. Oh my word. This is Fred, owner of this Mark II MX-5. I'm super happy with it. You're super happy as it's well. It's an MX-5. So it's an yeah, MX-5 and it runs. Yeah, uh, it does. Tell me a little bit about the car. How long have you had it? Um, have you maintained it very well? Yeah, so I've owned it four years. It was my second car. I've done lots of bits and pieces. Did the timing belt myself. I've been to Le Mans, been to Frankfurt, Belgium, been loads of places, but it's just got to the end now. I've not had a proper look around, but I can hear it running. So you've got yourself a deal. <laughs> Thank you very so, much. I've taken Please. a lead again. No! Yeah. <laughs> I was so close. <laughs> you, you snatched it away from me because yeah. you called him back. I did bring him back. Anyway, we'll see you in the morning. The Mazda MX-5, the Mark II versus the Renault Megane Trophy. Should we have a quick walk through this car? First thing I want to say is it's brilliant. I love it and I've forgotten how awesome a stock MX-5 is with just an exhaust. 1.6 litres, 188,000 miles on the clock, but it feels tight, feels nimble. The steering is really good. The tracking is perfect. The steering wheel is straight and that's really rare for any car you paid £500 for. You've got a chance here. Well, I mean, earlier you said you were going to spank me and you were only going to do 50%. That was off camera. Right, so let's have a very quick look at Fred, the Mark II MX-5. We've got wind-up windows. Those were a thing in the 1920s when I was 40-something. The roof is leaking a tiny little bit. It's not too bad at all. There's a few rust patches here and there, but for £500, I think it's amazing that A, we bought a car, and B, we bought an MX-5. I'd say one issue is the tyres, though. They look a little bit ropey. I'm calling a spin. I'm going to come off track couple of times at least because I will try. Don't you dare do that. Well, I want to win, don't I? Yeah, well, yeah, but that, we want him to be safe, don't we? He's, he's our, one of our colleagues. Shall we have a quick look at the, uh, the big daddy? This is what Ethan's going to be driving. Megan RS Trophy, 1.8 turbo, rear wheel steering, up to 60, about 5.8 seconds. So you've got a very good tool to get a very good time. I'm going to make you as fast as possible. I, mean, so, if I can't beat you in this. There's just no hope. Yeah. The no problem hope. isn't here, it's here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go out with Ethan in the McGann Trophy. I'll show you the lines very quickly. I'll set a lap with you in the car and then you'll drive around with me in the passenger seat. I won't say anything. We'll see what your time is. Then we'll see after a bit of training how close you can get to my time. You'll have five laps to set your fastest lap time and then I'll have five laps in Fred to try and beat it. Out of 10, how far out of your comfort zone are you? I'm completely out of my comfort zone. There's 10. A 10? Uh, yeah, I don't want to do this at all. Really? Genuinely, yeah, yeah, I don't want to. Excellent. All right, should we do a very basic timed lap? All right. Three, two, one, go. Okay, so what we're going to do now is swap over. Ethan, you jump in the driver's seat. I'll go in the passenger seat. You do a lap by yourself. I won't okay. say anything. And um, I go will for it. Go for okay. it. Okay. Yeah. But I will time it and then we'll see how close you can get to me. Three, two, one, go. Still, uh, am I still in? Well, I think I was in second. But I mess that up. Forty-six point five four. 
Well, that like is slow. It's all right. That there is are, slow. There are a lot of areas where you can make up speed very quickly. So first thing, the start was pretty good. I think the traction control helps quite a lot. Yeah. Don't go into fourth, leave it in third. Oh, uh, okay. You can go slightly faster. You were doing about 48 miles an hour okay. in that left-hander. You yeah. can be doing about 55. Uh, okay. So yeah, stay yeah. wide. Yeah. You don't need to okay. tap on the brake or anything like that. Brake in a straight line yeah. into second. Yeah. And then you can pretty much keep it in second all the way round, round okay. the hairpin. Third will get you to probably 85 miles an hour. Okay. Do exactly the same, okay. just, just be faster. Be smoother on the steering as well. Okay. Because you're right. doing that a little okay. bit. Okay, in three, two, one, go. Stay out wide. That's it, that's it. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. Go, 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 and brake into second. Throttle, 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 throttle. Brake, nice and smooth. That's it, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Progressive, progressive, progressive. Boot it. Boot it, boot it, boot it, boot it, boot it. Go, 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 go. Keep it in third, keep it in third. 44.89. Boot it, boot it, boot it, boot it, boot it, and brake. Trust the car a little bit more. Ah, All right, we're good, 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 a bit faster, a bit faster, a bit faster. That's it, try and hit the cone, try and hit the cone, nice. Over the curb, nice. Bit of acceleration and hard on the brakes, into second. And then don't mess this one up, nice and progressive. Slow, 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 good, 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 good. Boot it, 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 and brake, 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 brake. Nice, be patient, be patient, be patient, be patient, be patient. That's it, go, 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 go. Floor it, floor it, floor it, floor it, floor it. Go, go, go. Into third, leave it in third. Go, 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 Let's go for it. Come on, Fred. Come on, Fred. 43.9 to beat. I think this is going to be difficult. Me I there. think he's going to one-time you. I think he's just going to... This is really? it. Really? Yeah. Oh, no. Three, two, one, go. Oh, good start, Fred. Going to keep you in second. Don't trust the tyres. Come on, Fred. Nice and easy does it. Right, nice and gentle here, Fred. Don't want any heroics. Don't want that. Come on, Fred. Come on. Power, 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 power. No. Come on. No. Come no. on, little MX5. No. Oh, I love this car already so much. <sighs> oh. 45.46. A little part of me hoped that I was closer. Three, two, one. A little bit better here. That, tra that transition was <laughs> lovely. No, that is not the fastest way round, but it is the coolest. Come on! <laughs> that was not it. Pretty much the same, 45.43. Go. Ah! Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh! <laughs> 
Save it. All right, I'm ready. No drifting at that top. Cock it. No. Better start. Oh no! <laughs> I think that might have been a 44! And... Alex, you did that in 43-23. Yeah! Are you right, mate? What's the f point? What were we trying to achieve here? This is a good thing. No, because the underdog has lost. You're not the underdog I am here. The under no, you're not. I'm the the MX5. No, the driver is the underdog. The MX5 is always the underdog. He's so upset. Yes! <laughs> Bow down. This is just all stupid. Are you alright? How have I not beaten you in that? <laughs> I genuinely don't understand. It would be one of the worst MX-5s as well. So what we've done today, ladies and gentlemen, is put fast driver slow car versus slow driver fast car and the fast driver with the slowest car won. The Mazda MX-5, the best car in the world. The answer is always this car. Am I right? By the way, not to take away from the Megane RS Trophy, because that is a super capable, fun car. It's a car you can daily. If you enjoyed this video, then make sure you subscribe to Carthrow, because we've got some really cool stuff coming up. The link is over there. And to check out more videos, it's down there. Ethan, play us out. Go away. He gone. Go away. You've Come upset on, Jack. Him. Let's you've, go to the hairdressers. You've upset him. Yeah, yeah, poor guy.